Hello friends of the Northern Entertainment and welcome back to another episode of my Sim Airport Let's Play series. We are today, yeah, just going to continue on our little, what is going on here? There's so many people just... Oh, they're waiting around here on, on the pickups, of course. But uh, yeah, um, I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about the roadmap um, about this game. Uh, yeah, where it's going, where it is right now. As you see, it is still early access. It is an early alpha version, of course. Um, the developers really care about their product, though, because they quite regularly update this. Uh, in fact, every two, three days... Uh, you get some update where they fix the uh, a little bit more with queuing up and whatnot. And uh, one of the things I really like is when you look at the the roadmap. Um, and if you look at the things that are supposed to come, then uh, let me just read it right from the roadmap. That is passenger transportation, drop off and pick up via LRT or light rail train. Uh, parking structures, more objects to satisfy, entertain, and profit of your passengers, namely bars, restaurants, takeout and fast food, delis, etc. Duty fee shops, newsstands, clothing stores, etc. System depth for more sale items, inventory control, custom pricing, miscellaneous entertainment options like arcade games, newsstands, TVs. Then new systems and existing system, ex ex bleh, existent system improvements. Uh, whether that the weather system improved uh, impacts of the operations, uh, staff assignments, um, information system increase impact, additional objects, research additions, game progression rebalance, airlines that require services, offices, launches, uh, refuel systems, refuel truck, fuel pipelines, uh, and uh, reporting data charts, historic insights, and on the miscellaneous, of course, Steam Workshop integration with safe and sharing and mod support so there is really a lot that's coming yet um and with that said let's look now here how our airport is doing uh money is slowly coming back in as i said in the last episode we are going to add another part of the terminal here gonna uh, kind of extend the terminal out a little bit more and then gonna put a uh, um now we're gonna put a, uh, a a large uh, pad in or a large uh, actually we're gonna do that now no we're not gonna sell this uh, we're gonna build we're gonna build 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 objects a large gate we're gonna put an extra large gate is what I wanted And we want to make sure that this one is the right way around, so we don't end up with, uh... Yeah, see, that's that's exactly what I thought. That this is how it goes. There! And that costs us no money. Why does that cost no money? Well, because last time, if you remember, I had uh, the steel already bought for this, so... Uh... Yeah, we just can go ahead here and uh, then 757 and A321. I wonder I wonder what we need for A A380 to land. Well, for A380 to land, we need first of all a really 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 big uh, um <coughs> now 2934 oh, man this is gonna cost some monies well I guess it's all in a day's work right all in a day's work oh we have seven hundred and fifty dollars left oh yeah oh yeah wow they look pretty pretty roughed up there some of those passengers they look like they spent the last four days on the airport <laughs> but uh yeah no i i do really enjoy the game and i'm really excited to see where it goes from here um and and you guys i know did enjoy that too and i did read the comments yes you guys are correct i did i don't know how and why but i put a lot of uh, electronics vending in here what i didn't put in was 
Did you land or start? No, you landed. Um, yeah, what I didn't put in was, of course, um, actual vending machines where they could eat something. What is going on here? Don't arc. Oh yeah, that, that that was one of the improvements that was made, as you can see. It is now per gate, um, where we can. It, it makes it a lot easier for us to to uh, no nah, to uh, to assign flights because now we can see right away um, what requires attention. Oh, afternoon arrival. Okay, um, we see now very very quickly what uh, what we have already uh, used up and where we can uh, fit another plane or two in uh, having said that let's have a look here um no let's have a look here and see if we find more interest from the airlines um i would love to have more windows here but that's okay okay they don't want nothing at the moment we have two am flights available hmm. a380 and a 747 yeah that's not gonna work for a while and we have one pm flight uh oh sure There. See, that's what I'm talking about. This is very, very nice. And one night flight. We do have a 777. Yeah, I can't accept a 777 at the moment because we don't have the the monies. Yeah, see, this is a 747, the 380, 380, 747. And uh, to be honest with you, before, we do, before I even think about uh, getting a... Oh. I wonder what the problem is here again. A lot of them might be hungry. Um, okay, I, <laughs> I have to open this up because otherwise you're gonna have a... We're gonna have somebody missing here. Oh wow, we are already back up to 7,000. Wonderful. So we can extend here a little bit more. However, I, before I'm gonna extend, we're gonna go ahead here and we are going to buy some food vending machines because, yeah, rather expensive stuff, but it is going to help a little bit with the satisfaction within the airport. Oh wow. Pigs! Look at those pigs! Ay ay ay! Who's landing? Ah, oh, there you are. It looks like a Southwest airplane, doesn't it? But yeah, guys, um, it is, uh, it is, it is, it is now eighteen, so half past six p.m. here. And we're gonna go ahead and look what operation six thousand dollars multi lane access finance is complete so we can once we have uh, and I'm probably gonna build the uh, offices here somewhere uh, once we have that we can absolutely go ahead then and uh, Oh yeah, look, there is indeed people using the vending machines and money is flowing. Wonderful, wonderful. Okay, well, they are definitely using the vending machines, but I can't see that there's any money coming. Hmm. Oh, wow, look at this. Vending machine income, 150. So that is definitely something. Um, yeah, we are going to put more in. 
most definitely because this makes indeed a difference and i have a plan of uh, building the first cafe here in the non-secure area where you then pretty much when you arrive at the airport before you go through the whole um yeah through the whole uh, protocol with uh We're gonna put one more here, later. Of course, what you have to keep in mind too is, the more vending machines you have, um, the more... Oh yeah, look at that, they are indeed a little bit hungry. So we might actually use the area here and... Uh, Yeah, we're going to use the area here and we're going to go ahead and uh, tch, they should almost queue up. Interesting. Who just arrived? Nobody. Oh, yeah, good. Yeah, maybe we should build here a little cafe too. 280 dollars now is the income from our vending machine so that is really nice to see um yeah of course once we have a cafe in uh, that will help significantly no of course that would be it's 150 per square meter um where is our Where would the object planning um, pricing schedule? Of course, research is, yeah. And we're gonna put the first one here. And I mean, this is really just, just me planning stuff out. Um, so that's one, two, three, four. I'm going to make that four by five. And then cafe area is going to be in here. And that's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six by six by six. Right there. Perfect. This is all outdoors, indoors. So if you put one here. And one here. And then we're out of money. Okay, that's okay though. We just leave that for now as is. And then around here and around here. And then we're going to put the wall around here. Yeah, I can make this nicely. The, and, the, and, and the inspiration for that one really is, uh, is the cafe that we sat in um, when uh, Ness and I went to Germany last year. I can't believe that this is almost a year ago now. My goodness, time sure flies. Um, but uh, yeah, the, the inspiration is kind of from that because the cafe was in, in the middle, uh, really just plopped in the middle there of the airport. And uh, I, I kind of like the, the idea rather than have it all tucked away in 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 one corner um having a cafe that's kind of in the middle and then kind of focuses the attention a little bit um that definitely works of course uh, what would help also here with the airport definitely would be to have our oh my <clears throat> yeah i would be frustrated too um what would definitely help as well is Ticketing machine, ticketing machine, ticketing machine. La 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 la. There you go. 
Not enough money. Well, I might as well sell this one then. Alright. Um, probably in the next episode we're gonna see this all starting to grow, uh, have the new offices and uh, have also uh, gar uh, garbage. Right, garbage. No, baggage. Yeah, definitely our three body scans are keeping up, no problem. This is very nice to see. Plenty of people at our vendor machines. Wow, this is insane. I did not think we're gonna make that much money with the vendor machines, but lo and behold, we do. So we're just gonna go ahead here and start building the walls for our kitchen area. So we can get this started. Here and then uh, we need a kitchen sink which is 1500 so we can we can add that before we run out of money. So we have a sink now, then we need... What else do we need? Um, bum, 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 bum. Pizza oven, refrigerator, prep card, cooker, and a sink. Good. Good, 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 good. There we have the sink. Pizza oven is 3500. Ouch. But, as they say, you gotta spend money to make money. And then maybe we're going to put one more large terminal here. Now keep in mind we have only so much room on this one. And I, I, I kind of... I'm kind of annoyed with myself that we just started with this little airport out. But we're going to see how far we can... We can advance. How far we can develop this airport. And uh, yeah, we just go from there. See, the overall happiness with the airport definitely uh, changed in a positive way ever since we started uh, using the food vendor machines. And again, guys, I did see the comments and I do appreciate that if you guys see something that I don't. Because I I tried to keep the commentary going. I tried to keep it somewhat interesting for you guys. Well, somewhat interesting. No, to keep it interesting for you guys. And uh, sometimes I miss things because of that. And that's just the way it is. I know there's other YouTubers that might have not a problem with that. I, however, do sometimes miss things, and I have no problem admitting that freely. Um, I guess that's the fun, because you guys see some things that I might miss, and uh, then you can, of course, inform me about that in the comments below. Speaking of the comments below, leave me a comment below if you enjoy the series still. And, uh, huh. So, you didn't miss much here, uh, probably seen there was a little bit of a cut um, and all you missed really is me skipping two full days at high speed just to make some more money. Um, I do want to get this coffee, uh, cafe built up here this episode, I told you guys that, so that's what we're gonna do here. And then we're gonna call it good. 
So we still need, we have the refrigerator and we have the refrigerator, we have, a, we all we need is a cooker. And a cooker is here that will be placed here and with that the kitchen is indeed open. I'm gonna do this, this, and this, and this, and this, this, and this, there, and that's that. So now we have still 19,000. With those 19,000, we're gonna get a cash, cash register in. And the cash register goes right here. And now we're going to start and put a couple of tables. Uh, one here. One here. One. Kind of want them a little bit uh, offset. So one here and one here. And we're gonna put another one here, and another one here, and maybe one more here. And that's good. Um, I guess we could put one more here. Oh, you don't know what? Why not maximize it? There and there and there. And that's driving me insane. But it's okay, as I said, we're gonna maximize the, uh... Okay, and the staff, uh, security food worker, we need one. There you go. And with that, we should see... Oh, yeah. That's right, assigned to this kitchen. And now our business here is open. Um, actually, uh, we will, since we have the money, add a coffee maker to the kitchen. And we will also add... No, where is that? Is it a storage shelf? No. Food vending, oh, where is it? Kitchen storage, adds crisp and a kitchen capability. So I'm gonna put this here. Behind him. And with that, we should be able to make some revenue here on the uh, on the cafe as well. Starting to think putting this coffee maker here was kind of a bad decision. Kitchen storage. Hmm. Interesting. Requires pizza oven. Should I get another food worker? Nope. Yeah, one of you guys can go. 
Thank you. Yeah, we definitely have now uh, something going on here. Wow, this is this cafe is wow. Something, all right. You know what? I am contemplating putting another bench here. One here and one there, just so. And then maybe another one here. Just to give it all a little bit of a more natural flow and whatnot. Um, it's it's kind of just by by its uh, design will redirect people a little bit more. They have to go past the cafe. I don't know if that really actually makes us any money, to be honest. It might be broken at the moment. It would be awesome if people would not run into our kitchen. That would be great too, but okay. What's definitely money, make money though is uh, food vending. So, let's put a couple more of those little bad boys in. Actually, what we could do as the very last thing for today is we're gonna expand a little bit on the foundation. And as you see, it is a ways to go yet, but uh, I think that's all good here. Um, that shall conclude today's episode which i do hope you guys enjoyed and if you did then please hit the like button leave a comment down below if you feel inclined to do so and until next time this is the northern alex signing off god bless <laughs>